Hey everyone, it's PresleyAdictoGames.com here, and today we're going to be taking this off of the engine. We haven't actually done an engine video in a long time, so it's good we're doing another one. So we're going to talk a little bit about the engine now. Cool. So before we took off the carburetor and the exhaust and kind of showed how all that worked, right? You remember that? So do you remember what happens when you pull the cord like to start it a little bit? What happens in there? It turns. It spins, right? So you don't have to do it right now, but... Yeah, so do you, do you see it spinning? Okay, so that spins. So now we're going to take this top piece off a little bit and look and see what's happening under here. We're just going to be a, a quick little next step of the engine, and then we'll have to take some more out. It's going to flip towards you. Whoa. Okay. Let's take a look. So now, wait, wait. Let's take a look. Yeah, so it's attached to the rope still. Let's take a look here and see what's happening. So this thing turns when you pull the rope, right? Does that thing also turn? Yep. This thing also turns? This whole thing, yeah, it turns, right, when you pull the rope. So that, the rope turns this little gear over here on the side, and that turns this big thing on top, okay? Now, let's talk about what happens when you pull it. Is this like a fan to keep it from overheating? Uh, it, it, it does keep some air going, right? But what what do you think this, this right here is? Can you tell? Nope. What does it look like? A piece of metal. piece of metal? It's black. Mm -hmm. What do you? What have you seen magnet. before? It's a magnet. It is a magnet. Okay. And then right over here, you've got another magnet. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's a gold key on it. So what happens when this turns, and this magnet passes by that magnet? It's moving. This magnet passes by this magnet. It stays. It can't move. It gets attached. And it stays. But what? What happens when two magnets move past mm -hmm. each other? What do they create? They create a magnetic mm -hmm. field. A magnetic field. And what's the magnetic field like? An electric field. An electric field. So, mm -hmm. what happens is this little box right here, it mm -hmm. captures that electric charge that's created when the magnet spins by, and it runs down this cable, and where does this cable go? Okay, it goes to the spark plug. To the spark plug. And what so does that make happen? The kabooming. And right, it makes the kabooming in the engine, right? And so what happens is that explosion that starts the piston, mm -hmm. and then the piston turns this Whee. when it the, this whole assembly turns when the piston goes, mm -hmm. and that makes the magnet go by here again. Mm -hmm. And, and so when the magnet really goes by here again, it makes another spark, and the piston goes again. So it just keeps making itself go. Right. This all goes really fast. It does go really fast. <laughs> and what you're making happen when you pull the cord is you're just making it spin and you start that process going. You can't pull it when it's off pressure. Oh. So uh, it makes that whole process start when you pull the cord. It turns this manually, the magnet fires, the, pulls gas into the piston, all the com internal combustion stuff mm -hmm. that we talked about and the carburetor, all of that stuff happens when you pull the cord. Mm -hmm. And then once it starts, it so keeps- This is like the it, core. That's right. It keeps going itself mm -hmm. once you get it going. Mm -hmm. And that's why the engine keeps running is because the piston turns this and this makes the piston turn and it just keeps feeding each other and itself and going over and over and over again. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool, huh? Yes. So more stuff that we've learned before. Magnets, uh, creating a magnetic yeah. field, which is captured and turned into an electrical charge, which goes to the spark plug, makes a spark, yep. makes an explosion. But you can't do the explosion because there's no gas or anything. Yeah, we don't have anything in there right now. Yes, but if we did have anything in there... Yeah, and it's also on. it's also moving the piston when you're doing that inside. We'll, we'll be able to see that a little bit later. Really, it is really moving. Yep, we'll do a test later and show how that works. Mm -hmm. But it's pretty cool, huh? So just a quick little update on where we're at on the engine, and we're going to take some more of this stuff apart here yep. and get deeper into the engine in the next video. Yep. It's, we've already gotten pretty deep into it. Bye. Thanks for watching. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.